Hey, hey, hey. How's everybody doing? Everybody's having a great day today. Turn my music down a little bit. And now we get to wait. Hey, everybody. Hope everybody's having a great day today. there we go all right I yeah, hope everybody's doing all right today <laughs> and there we go all right uh, fix my armor up real quick First, let's put it on. All right, there we go. It's getting a bit late, but I can deal with that later. I can throw up my desk a little bit. Good lord. <laughs> I didn't realize I had so much crap on my desk at the moment. All right. All right. Is it just putting it in the inventory with it to prepare it? Yeah, okay. All right, shoes repaired, armor repaired. Three. And there we go. All right. So, for the next couple of days, uh, I'm gonna be having tons of fun. Nearby flowers zero. It's not even searching for them, I believe. Point thirteen of a serving left. All right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it wasn't a whole lot left over there. It's soft bronze. All right. Grab pies. I'm going to need charcoal to, fill, to fuel those two. All right. So, oh wait, no, I had more than enough pies on me already. <laughs> if I had done even the slightest amount of looking, I would have known that. Alright, well then, we sleep. We don't worry about the <laughs> drifters threatening my house. Yeah, we worry about that later. All right. Gonna eat one of my pear pies. Yeah, another one. <coughs> oh, excuse me, sorry. 
All right. Well, all this should be... Yeah. That's all good. It's a lot of hardened copper. I need... 400... No, 560. All right. 512, which means I need to get to 550. <laughs> 48. All right. Where'd I put my crucible? No, like legitimately, where did I put it? Do I place it down somewhere? Throw it in one of these? Right here and I'm just very blind. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yeah, no. That's a, that's a bit more than what I need. need 560 <laughs> now I need 460 right no 560 560 there we go <laughs> all right well Considering that I can't put hot items in, I'm going to be stuck with this for a little while. <laughs> 560 plus that, but yeah, that'll be enough. Okay. Whew! I was a little bit worried there for a second. I'm going to wait for it to get a little bit lighter outside. <laughs> but it is uh, currently snowing. <laughs> so that may be a little hard. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I get the feeling my body temperature is going to rapidly decline, but that is okay. All right. <laughs> Little bit of drifter annihilation going on here, guys. It's okay. Get rid of that body. Just the one that spawned around my house, I think. Oh no, it's because there was a rift behind my house. That's okay. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> so where do I want to... Do some tree mining that's a little, or uh, tree harvesting that's a little bit closer to home. <laughs> mm, I could cut right across there, or cut down this way, or I could just take out this forest up here. <laughs> First, might actually be a good idea is to uh, mine out the area that's like directly behind my house, you know? <laughs> that might be a little bit better. Um, why do I have a scythe on me? Where can I put this that's not already filled up? Here. <laughs> All right. Hey. Oh, come on. 
Nothing? Seriously? Dang. That sucks. <laughs> well, these uh these trees are gonna be fun. At least. <laughs> Mostly because if I remember correctly, there are bears and wolves around this area. So it's gonna be fun. Let me uh put some of this in my inventory real quick. Like where I can grab it. So I don't have to worry about wolves coming and ganking me. I should eventually mine out this uh, little copper deposit that's right here beside my house. I'll eventually take care of that, you know? I also probably should have taken out the, uh... Man. My brain really is not working right now. And there we go. It's all cold. <laughs> yep, definitely working smarter, not harder with that. <laughs> that was very smart of me. Alright. Oh, that was also very smart of me. All right, well, there's all that in there. Let me grab some of these right now. <laughs> Give or press Y on that. I'll get rid of most of that on my inventory. All right. There we go. Calm. All right. Whatever you want to say, sir. It's gonna, <laughs> it's really not gonna be uh, super interesting today. Oh, there's a bear. I heard him. Usually, if you can hear him, you're a bit too close. Let me grab my uh, shears real quick. And I might want to get my inventory in line first, too. Alright. First, we do that. Can be all the way down here at the end. Pop that up there. That can be right there. Uh, one over. What's up? It's going pretty good. Uh, finally got to the... Got <laughs> really into the tin bronze. Um, we got a bunch of bronze and a bunch of copper. Since uh, the last time you stopped by. And uh, first winter's coming. So I started up some bloomeries. And I'm getting some... Uh, wood and some stone for winter that's coming up as you can already see it's in the negatives yeah i uh i have failed at making a usable charcoal pit three times already <laughs> all of which was in last stream um my uh charcoal pit that i built it's right here i forgot to plug up I forgot to plug it up, and 
this entire room was filled with charcoal. All right up here is my little charcoal p bit. So it all burned down. <laughs> and I wasted several inventories worth of, uh, <laughs> of firewood doing that. And I was so mad. I was so defeated yesterday, or uh, Tuesday. I was so mad about that. Yeah. <laughs> Especially when the highest level tool I have is, uh, or at the time was copper. I had only made uh, like a couple tin bronze axes. So I was, I was suffering. Also, there's a bear somewhere around me. And I do not know where he is. Um, I know that it is a black bear. But uh, he is on my ass at the moment. And I do not know where he is. And he scares me. I don't want to add another one to the death counter because of a friggin' bear. <laughs> you know. As you do. Like, I finally have enough, like, actual, like, health packs, or, like, healing items that I don't really have to worry, but I'm still going to worry about them. And that, uh, that freaks me out every single time. Yeah, and I, the I, idea for today is just clear out the area around my house of wood. Ooh. Yeah, I have yet to set up like a little cheese area so that we don't have to worry about them. I haven't really interacted with them much. Other than getting killed by them like at least four of the eight deaths that I have at the moment. <laughs> so, yeah. I've interacted with them a little bit, but not a whole lot, you know? Alright. Let's see. And doing this will actually help me get a better idea of what the area around my house is like. So that way I'm not having to guess where I can put stuff. Oh yeah! Uh, lazy. I think the since the last time you watched, uh, I've actually gotten bees. But sadly, I got it right as winter was, or like right as it hit below the working temp for them. <laughs> so I finally got bees, but it's too cold for them. The big gating resource. <laughs> bees. Yeah, I'm, uh... Phew. That took me forever. I actually, like, went really, really far <laughs> trying to find bees, only to find out that I had some, like, this close to my house. Like, I didn't have to go all the way down there. It was, like, as short a distance as this. But that was still really upsetting. <laughs> Yeah, the only reason I couldn't find bees is because all the area around me is, um... Is either, like, short ones like this, where it's too wet for one to spawn, or it was pine, like, pine forests, where if it spawned, it was so high up that you could barely hear it. And that's what happened. <laughs> so, after stream one day, I was just like, you know what? I'm going to spend however long it takes after stream to try and find one. And I found one. It took me, like, a couple hours. <laughs> and that was, that was so much worth it. But it's going to take forever for these guys to actually, like, swarm now. So I'm going to have to wait an entire year for them. Yep, lagging out my game. <laughs> so
So I literally down so that will help as long as you don't have um golden combs installed at the same time, which I do. Um and that would have been a mess. But yeah, it will help. I uh I just got really salty. And uh I downloaded um AM Finder which just helps you find blocks, and I literally just started searching for the wild beehives. So that... That, uh, that definitely helped out. Yeah, I think that's what it was. Uh, it's one of the, it's a mod, it's a newer mod in the, um, on the mod page. Uh, it's literally just a locate block function within like a 10 block radius of your player. Yeah, it's uh, it was interesting. Yeah. Let's see. How much wood do I have? Not a whole lot. I have a whole lot of other things though. <laughs> Yeah, there's just an arrow. There was just an arrow floating here in the air. Good lord. Also, hey, Popper. How you doing, man? Oh, there's the fucker. There he is. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> All right, let's grab the bow and arrow, my friends. <laughs> <laughs> when I said I don't know where he is, it's because he's been in the trees. <laughs> Alright, what does it take to make like an actual recurve bow? I think I have the tin bronze for this. Leather. Yeah, they gr they literally will just go up. Do I have any leftover leather? God, help me please. I need to have some leftover leather. No, it grew, it it went up. I remember seeing it, like, climb up the tree, because it was further away from the house last I checked. I don't think I have any more leather shit. Yeah, and I was in a densely forested area. Like, when I say it was in a different area, I mean, it wasn't there. It was over here the last time. Like, it wasn't... It wasn't there. It was like over here. Okay. So you said they climb at least three blocks, right? So, um, we're going four blocks tall, this motherfucker. <laughs> Very nice. Alright. I overshot. There we go. There's one. Wonder how many this is gonna take. Two. He's like right there. Three. Four. Oh, nice. Where is he? Oh, that's terrifying. Where is he? Did he run away? Or is he dead? God, I hope he's dead. Not dead. Not dead. Very much not dead. Where? <laughs> I am very terrified of this freaking bear. There he is. <laughs> Oh my god, he literally climbed the tree. You saw that, right? Like, he's down over there now. Overshot. 
Oh, uh, come on, 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 come on. Ah! Oh shit, I'm out of arrows. Shit, 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 shit. Please let my arrows fall down. Fuck! <laughs> they're just they're just living up there. No. No, 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 no. I'm not dealing with this right now. <laughs> no! Guys! <laughs> no! <laughs> He's right there! I'm so screwed! <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> He's right there. Do I just brave it? What's the condition of my armor right now? I think I'm just going to brave it. <laughs> I'm so terrified of these freaking animals. Alright. I did it! Yeah, let's go! Let's go! Oh, I hate these things so much. <laughs> Let's go! Let's get all my arrows back, please. They're the shitty arrows, but I would rather have them than no arrows. <laughs> okay. <laughs> my feet took so much damage, my god. I'll find the rest of them eventually. My cat has decided to jump up onto my desk to make sure that I am okay. I'm okay, Nikki. I'm okay, honey. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for making sure I'm okay. <laughs> she is. She's great. Yeah, yeah, hi. And here's hoping she does not step on my keyboard and start randomly doing things. Because <gasps> she's done that before on streams. Alright. I think I got all of them. <clears throat> oh my god, I gave myself the hiccups. Ow! She is... She wants to be part of the action, guys. Alright, let's clear out as much of this as I can. Because it looks like trees from the... from the view up top. Alright. My goal will be to be eventually just burn down all these deer ferns. I hate them with a passion. Like all the ferns. There's so many of them. Also, hopefully, with the, uh, destroying of this forest, I will be able to have, uh, <laughs> things stop spawning around my house. And by things, I mean wolves. Because <laughs> God, I hope that they will stop spawning. I've had, in my first year, like, three... <laughs> I've had, like, in my first year of this world, um, <clears throat> like a full-on, like, three, three or something packs of wolves spawn. Like, not just, just a few, like, literal packs, and I am so over them. Just all the area around my house. And you want to know what makes this even better, Popper? I have, um... 
I have uh, wild farming on, which means these things will spread if I give them the chance to. Which means I actually need to do, like, routine maintenance around my house if I want to get rid of it all. Alright. So much fun. You're good. Also, that wolf is too close for comfort. Way too close for comfort. Where is it? Is it still following me? It still is. Hello, sir. Oh, it actually took fall damage. Cool. Ah, <laughs> oh, dude, I don't want to be using my one of my tin bronze axes yet. All right. Alright, let's start the fun stuff of, uh, filling up this area down here. And actually remembering that, um, it needs to be done. Like, this needs to be sealed up before I finish. Alright. Let's go. So much firewood. And I trust you, this is not going to be enough. <laughs> Alright. And I threw my axe down as well, that's great. Alright. And the only thing I need to make sure that I do is leave myself a path out of here. Oh, oh, no, we're not doing this. Not right now. <laughs> All right, then we start working this way. And all right. Don't mind me. <laughs> Just filling my inventory with a ton of firewood. You know, normal things. As you do. Alright. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. I'm going to lose it if, um, I end up forgetting to close this again. <laughs> like, just full-on start it and forget to close it when I ignite it. Alright. I got most of it filled, surprisingly. Alright. Let's, uh, let's eat something real quick. There we go. Eh, I could do one more, but I'm not going to. Ten bush meat. Um... What was my... Not character inventory... It's not journal. It's not still... It's not that... It's not that... Honestly, I don't remember. Where is it? Is there not a thing to show? Huh. There's not a thing to show quests. 
I don't know. I'm awful. <laughs> uh, I do know Parson of Quest. He wants uh, 20 of some kind of... Uh, 20 or something of some kind of uh, meat. Let's go! Alright. How much more meat do I have? I have one really spoiled meat. And some cooked, some charred, some cooked. I wonder if he'll accept that. Well, it doesn't really matter. Uh, let me actually do like a small charcoal burn. Because I actually do need some like pretty soon. Let's do two stacks. There we go. This will be a one by th a one tall by four burn, I believe. Is what that requires. Let me do it down here. There's my shovel. All right. We we'll grab that. Get rid of those. Come on. All right, and we cover. No, I said we cover. We don't take it out. Dang it. <laughs> All right. Let me grab a little bit of this grass here. Oh, one short. Am I able to use sticks for this? No. Okay. I have so many sticks, but I <laughs> really don't have a use for them all. Okay. So we come down here. Do I even have something to start this off? I don't. <laughs> Just doing this haphazardly at the moment. Alright. We'll grab the torch off the top of my house. How about that? <laughs> then we light. And... Boom. Alright. And now we wait. It shouldn't take too long. Alright. Oh, my pottery did finish. That's what this was from last last stream. Alright. Let me return the torch to the house. There we go. Okay. What do I do now? <laughs> well, I have some oak wood in here. And no... Oh, I did have one leather. Okay, so I can make a... I can make a bare bones recurve bow, it would seem. Yeah, just a normal recurve bow, but I could also make a higher tier recurve if I save. If I make one more. But I'm also not very smart, so I will probably forget that. Uh, bowl's not, it's not up there, nope. I just have a lot of storage around here, and just nothing with it in it. Oh, that has, uh, honey in it. Alright. Four days, twelve days, three days. Well... <clears throat> I... Actually, I could go to that guy and finish off that quest. I will actually probably do that. Did I put my no where did I put my normal bucket? There it is. Well, if I'm having to do winter anyways, 
That bush meat is going to take forever, oh my god. <laughs> uh, for reference, I made a mistake in doing, like, very, like, very early on, like, just salting some meat and then forgetting about it. That was, uh, <laughs> that was really smart on my part. Alright. Do that. Pull that up. Over there. And we can dump that. What I need to do is I need to make some things with tannins. And I thought, you know, this might be a better way to get started with this. All right, fill that in, take it back out. Okay. I love just the massive molds that I have in my house <laughs> that are currently serving like little to no like actual function. It's great. Let's see, that one doesn't have anything in it. Neither does that. Alright. This guy, however, I think I can... I uh, know, because he's not in the carry capacity mod. Okay. Molten copper, cool. Pour into this. And we're gonna get a ton of copper plates. Yo! High level metalworking skill, let's go! Alright. Uh, processing, metalworking. Hammer expert, get back durability. Um, your heavy hits on slag works as a split. Interesting. Blacksmith. Uh, items you forge now have quality with a base value of one and a maximum of five. With quality parts, we'll also create items with quality. Cool. Armor and tools with quality have increased stats. I already have a mod that does something like that, so I'm not going to take this profession. However... Oh. Oh! Oh, it's a ex exclusivity thing, I think. Well, it doesn't matter. Um, metal recovery seems cool. Smelter isn't great because the way you get experience for metalworking is by units of metal poured. I mean, it's good in the long run, but uh, that'll actually be good. <laughs> All right, that'll take forever. So that needs to be lime water. Let's grab the quern. Put that in there. I can also put the mass plate molds in there. Where did I put my plates? Are they up here? They are up here, okay. Uh, um, do I have any lime? Clear quartz. You know what, I'm going to, to, to just cheat for a little bit <laughs> and use one of the mods I have installed that allows me to just make candles out of uh, animal fat. So I can just take my fat and make candles. Uh, what does it take to make a lamppost? Lamppost, board, twine, and that, okay. So, let's make 11 candles. And now, we make 10 <laughs> copper uh, guys. That's okay. 
Uh, if I wanted to make more, I can always um, cheat a little bit. Is that lime or is that quick lime? That is quick lime. That is lime. All right. Yeah, that's a, that was a bit much. Uh, is it 10? How much is it per liter of water? I forget. Well, I'll find out. Oh, there we go. <laughs> 10 contents of lime water. That's used for... Yeah, making soaked hides. Alright. Uh, where are... All my hides. I have some huge hides. Uh, one huge hide requires ten, so I can do five huge hides. Twenty hours will make four huge hides. Uh, let me make some tannins real quick. Uh, is it five per? Yeah, it's five. One, two, three, four, five. 50 liters a week tannin, that is okay. Uh, I know there's a thing with the acorns that I can do, that I have a whole bunch of. Where are they? They're somewhere in here. I'll see them when I see them. There they are. Alright. I can make fresh acorns, then they cure and do dry acorns. We'll make shelled. And I can make them into, into uh, wet leached. Cool. Ah. If I remember correctly, mixing them in a barrel leaves tannins behind? Yeah. Alright. So, I'm going to do a bunch of these. Alright. Two. I can do two. Three? Maybe? That is not, <laughs> that is not what I needed. Four, five. And it's 10 to one, I believe. Is that what it is? Yeah, 10 to one. So doing five will do that. Fresh acorns, you have to place them down and let them dry out. Is it like that, or is it like... No, it is like that, okay. Well, I hope that works. <laughs> Here's hoping. Alright. I don't need to worry about that. There's eight more copper plates. They can live... somewhere. In my inventory, because that's where I had it. There we go. All right, we eat a little more. Man, these really aren't that great. <laughs> then we sleep, and then we can head over to the villagers in a little bit. When I wake up, that is. All right. Can head over to the villagers. I've got enough stuff on me. Let me actually go empty out my inventory a little bit. Oh no, this is this is what I wanted it for. Okay. Uh quern. Because I'm not gonna really be using that for a little while. <laughs> Everything is slowly getting snowed on. put that there. I don't need the arrow or the bow on me at the moment. The shoot mold can live in here for now. I don't need the flax twine on me at the moment. And I don't have any flax already done up. Alright. Uh, the fern can live in here. 
soak in the lanterns for the moment. Oh yeah, I also don't need that on me. <laughs> okay. All right, let's go. Yeah, that's expected, honestly. Yeah, I think my uh, body temp is going to drop, like, really quickly. Because it's getting cold, cold. Negative one degree Celsius. But I'll be fine. Toss that up there. All right. I bet you that there's already some ice that is formed around this guy's, uh, around this guy's, um, house, like around the little village area. I think I also installed a mod that adds some more quests than what were already here. With the, the VS quest mod. I can't remember if I did or not. But I do remember accepting a guy's quest for... Parsnips. So I will get parsnip seeds. Which I already had some. But now I'll have more. Look at the little rabbit run. Look at him go. There's already some ice spawning here. Or freezing, I should say. Alright. I'm not going to make that. I thought so. <laughs> I thought so, and I still went for it. <laughs> I was being very smart there. My shoes are really doing some heavy lifting, y'all. <laughs> Alright. That is not the right key. So we go down to this guy because I accepted his Parsnips quest. But yeah, I hope everybody's doing it. How have you all been today? Ugh. I hope everybody's had a good day. You know what? I think while I'm waiting for the temperatures to come back up, I may actually explore the top of that at some point. That'll probably be really interesting. <laughs> Grab a bunch of ladders, go up to the top of that. That actually sounds like a fun idea. I think I like the idea of not having the effect head just pop up randomly. Oh, my back. Look at these guys. They're living peacefully over here. I mean, it's getting real cold, but they're living peacefully. Hi, Bernadette. Active quests. It's meat meat. Okay. Alright. That makes sense. Not you over here. 20 of any kind of meat. Well. I'm sure that there isn't any kind of meat over here. Let me actually turn up the game sounds real quick.
Are you kidding me? There's bees right there. <laughs> I'm going to lose it, y'all. Well, if I want more bees... <laughs> oh my gosh, you know what? Screw it. Getting out of here. That is hilarious. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> uh, oh, and I got some propolis. Oh. Green for that, cool. Um. Hive. How do you make? Mixing beeswax with board. Okay. Let's we'll see if the bees are still angry at me. I ran away. Maybe they still are? Oh, the bees aren't here anymore. Okay. Did I get another piece of propolis? I did. And another one. No, I might as well just... Break it down, y'all. Break it down. <laughs> but that was that was funny. <laughs> like, oh, I'm gonna turn up my sound so that way I can actually hear things, and immediately find bees. That was that was funny. I can get rid of that waypoint at least. <laughs> That was, that was funny. That was actually really funny. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Avalanche! Yeah, this is where I started my uh, deforesting adventure. Last stream. It was uh, literally in this area where I found my last bees. Let's go. I don't know how, but this is staying up. I'm honestly impressed. Fall. At least there's a lot of wood around me. All right. Yeah. Oh, and I put my uh, shears up so I can't carve my way through these. That's funny. Can you lose beehives? I can't remember. I can't remember if you can lose a colony. I mean, I, I think you can. But honestly, I haven't really messed with bees a whole lot, so. It'd be a new one for me. Alright. I wonder how much more wood I'm going to need for uh, my charcoal pit. I'm expecting quite a bit. 
That's why I'm chopping out a big area here. But, uh... I'll find out eventually, you know? And that eventually will be when I get back home. Causing an avalanche because of a tree falling. Let's go. Yeah, I'm playing with uh, sand, gravel, and soil instability. So much fun. All right, yeah, I have, um... <sighs> crimson maple seeds back at the house. Those will be fun to plant. Let me get... Maybe one more stack. <laughs> and then I'll be good. Yeah. That should be enough. Hopefully. Let's see if I can find any more animals to... Harvest. Because he needs 20 of any kind of meat. And this meat is only good for how long? 12 hours. So I need to hurry up on that. Oh yeah. One of the things that's gonna be really fun is finding iron. Like finding iron deposits. I don't think I've found any places with a good amount of iron in it yet. Is that a carcass? No. That's just the bottom of a tree. You know, I did bring my pickaxe with... Uh, both of my pickaxes with me. So I can probably get some of this bauxite. Because I know that's needed for steel making, if I remember correctly. It's uh, this way. Yeah, it's up there. You can see it. Ooh. Cool little area. I'll, uh, I'll check that out later. Rabbit. Two rabbits. Let's see if I can get at least one of them to go into a, uh, into the water. I did. And a chicken. All right. How much meat are you going to give me, sir? Is it just going to be one? Oh, no, it's two. Cool, cool, cool. All right. That rabbit is, uh, long gone. Is that a chick? No, that is a fully grown rabbit. Alright. Dead hen. Alright. Trying to nibble at my ankles. We go trying to get 20 let's go all right come here motherfucker there we go got him got her I should say I'm getting a ton of feathers from this, actually. Alright. Alright. Where... 
Where's the... There he is. There's the rooster. <laughs> Eventually, I'll get some of these guys over at my place, but, uh... Won't be these ones. I can tell you that much. An ore vessel. And a food vessel. Ooh, rice grain. I actually don't think I have any rice at my house. That'll actually be really good. <laughs> Alright. Do I have enough of these? It does not matter. Okay. Um. If I cut across this way, I will have enough time to get over to that guy. And then I can make my way back home. If I just cut through here. <laughs> nope. Nope. Big mountain in the way. Not going to happen. That is not going to happen. Also, hi, Elrock. You guys will probably be the second thing I tame. Or domesticate, I should say. Is that more copper? That is more copper. I mean, I found a massive copper vein underneath my base, so I probably won't need me searching for these things for a while. But, uh, that is okay. It's always good to have a backup, you know? I also found a good amount of tin, too. So, all's good. Ow. Ow. Crab! 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 Primitive survival crab! We're eating crab legs tonight! Also, they always have a knife on them, which is a funny meme. I find that hilarious. Because I've killed two of them, and both of them have had, uh, <laughs> stone knives on them. Alright. Bernadette! Bernadette! Don't you dare go to sleep yet. Active quests. Complete. What did I get? Parsnip seeds. She will give me more parsnip seeds. I do not need more parsnip seeds. What did this guy give me? I have literally forgotten. More parsnips. <laughs> Dang it. I don't think I had the mod installed. That gives more quests. Dang nabbit. Let's actually find out if I do or not. <laughs> Give me one second. <laughs> we go to... Here. Data... Mods. Do I do quest? I forget which one it was. Oh my gosh. Oh well. Let's see how quickly I'll be able to get home before it, uh, gets too dark. I'm at 60% lightness correction. Hopefully I'll be able to get back home soon. <laughs> I think by the time I do, my, um, charcoal should be done by now. Hmm. 
All right. Oh god. Uh, cheaty mode activate. <laughs> I need to get back home. It's dark. I need to get back home. Awful parkour. Let's go. As a branch in the way. All right. Nope. Not that one. Not color correction. Screen brightness. Bring it back down to sixty. I just wanted to get up the hill. Alright, let's get out of here. How long before that crab meat goes? 1.9 days. I am going to be fine. Because I can do some dumb stuff with this crab meat and I'm going to love it. I wonder what the actual, like spawn rules for the primitive survival crabs are. I also don't think I have a mod in here that allows me to capture these guys easily. Which is going to be fun. Huh. <sighs> But, uh, who knows? Am I able to jump into that one? I am. That could have ended worse. Whee! Alright. Soaking wet. I always am. <laughs> Wait. That is a rabbit down there. Uh, he's going to die if I keep chasing him. There he is. I mean, I won't. I have enough stamina for that. Alright. If I now... Oh yeah, I'm still so good wet. Okay. Surprisingly, it is still kind of warm. <laughs> Alright, what can I do with the crab meat? We're gonna find out. Alright. Crab meat. Can make into raw crab meat nuggets. Let's go! <laughs> yes! Hundred and forty saturation. Very nice. Fresh for eighteen hours. But with the five I have, can be put into a pie. I think the smashed raw and then at three hundred saturation, so they're not as good as red meat or bushcraft meat. But they still count as meat, which means I can put them into a meat pie. All right. How long do these guys have, by the way? Hours. Hours. Okay. Uh, well, <laughs> think while I'm waiting for this to get all good, I can do a little bit of cooking. All right. I love that I'm slowly running out of space. It is amazing. Okay. Where did that go? 17 up here. Okay. We're going to grab that. Boom. <laughs> and those have not dried out yet. Come on. 
they were almost fully dried. Dang it. All right, we're gonna light these guys on fire. And we're gonna get started with the meat pies. Or with just the pies. Because <laughs> I forget what type of pies I made. One is meat. One is meat. One is meat. They were all meat. Okay. <laughs> uh, because it has to. All right, let's make some uh, let's make some nuggets. Here we go. We got some little crab meat nuggets. Think I have some more dough? If I do not, then I'm a liar. I it lo it looks like I'm a liar. Yep, I'm a liar. All right. Four years. 17 years. One year. Cool. Several years. <laughs> cool, 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 cool. So I don't have to worry about those going bad for a while. <laughs> 18 days. 18 days. How many... That is cabbage. That is not what I wanted. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. <laughs> Nine stages. <laughs> Man, that sucks. Nine stages for that, too. Okay. So it looks like amaranth is just going to be my better rye seeds. Right? 60 saturation. I don't know how much the amaranth flour gives, or how much the amaranth bread gives. But it looks like that may just be a better rye. Currants, parsnips. I have a lot of parsnips. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of flax. All right, these guys are done. Boom, boom. And while I'm waiting for those, I can come up here. Mine out. my little guy down here all right how much charcoal did I get out of this not a whole lot but it's gonna be enough because I want to make some um I want to make some greenhouses when I have the chance So that way I can try and grow shit. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> I probably won't be able to. But I can hope, right? Alright. <gasps> Look at that! There's snow on top of this! Oh, that's so cool! <laughs> Okay. Um... That's good. Yeah, I think I still have to find some in my area. Iron ore, show overlay. Yeah, I don't have any iron. Like, in anywhere that I have, uh... Ooh. No, there is some iron all the way out here. Near, next to my chalk. <laughs> but it's poor. Like, very poor. And up here... Uh... Never mind. <laughs> uh, I'm going to take that back. Um... If that's poor, then I'm... Lying. So, I may have some iron all the way down here by... <laughs> by this area here. Uh, okay. I might have some over here by this bauxite. I'm not entirely sure. I'll have to check later. Ooh. Pressing all the wrong buttons again. Alright. Ah, oh, I charred my pies! Dang it! 
I waited too long. All right. Well, I get to sit here and watch this now. <laughs> what do these cook at? Oh, that don't help. <laughs> it does not help. Well, I just get to watch it then. Yeah, so I get to... search the areas around me, honestly. Because some of these suck. Ooh, I got a goods trader up there. I forgot about that. Yeah, I'll have to look into it later. These aren't going to cook, are they? <laughs> no, because I waited too long, didn't I? Oh, no, they're cooking, they're cooking. Okay. Maybe I was a bit too <laughs> rushed. All right. Um I'm Trying to think where would the iron be? I mean, I do have some out here. Maybe there's some more, like, up off this way. But I don't want to travel all the way out there. Let's not burn these. Alright. Let me go ahead and cut these guys up. Alright. There we go. Are these not the same? Oh my lord. <laughs> one's red meat. One's red meat. What? Why? Oh, it's because of the pattern on the top, ain't it? It is. Dang it. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> Alright. These are still fresh acorns. Fresh acorns after 24 hours become dry acorns. All right. Well, they'll happen eventually. These guys will be fine. Two days, six hours. Actually, this one may not be. <laughs> okay. What's up? Oh! Game crashed for a re some reason. Ooh. Uh oh. There it goes. That's not what I meant to click. Something's off. Is that better? No. <laughs> Something's going on. Interface, resizable, there we go. Hopefully I didn't lose a whole lot of, um, what's the word? Hopefully I didn't lose a whole lot of progress. <laughs> that would suck. Let's hope I didn't lose a whole lot of progress. I hope I didn't, at least. Hopefully that's un that's not unfortunate. All 
Oh. I hadn't done the pies yet. Which means I can catch them before they're burnt. Let's go! <laughs> Alright. I wonder what caused that crash. I honestly wonder. You know what? It might have been the acorns. It might have been the acorns. That wouldn't surprise me, honestly. Alright. Um, let's go ahead and cut these. Alright. Do that. Toss those up there. And toss these in here. These guys are part baked. These things are actually really fun. It just sucks that you can't mix pies. This has to be cooked at 200. All right. And one last pie. Do this. I'm just going to get all the way back up. And screw it. Going to hit hot temperatures. Like really hot temperatures. All right. I can live in here now. All right. How long is that going to last in there? 30 days. It's okay. Eat that. Let's pour out this honeycomb into here. Here we go. There's all my honey out. Part baked over there. That's getting ripping hot. Which will hit temperature first? This one or this one? The answer was this one. And we can do one of the crab nuggets. Come on! Hit fully baked. Become bush meat pie. There we go. And. Here we go. All right. What do these cook at? 150? I could do that, but I'm not going to. Place on ground, smack with pickaxe. Whack him with a mallet is what it says? What the heck? That don't seem right. <laughs> Let me grab... Which of these is my mostly destroyed mallet? This one over here. No. That one. <laughs> it's not a mallet, it's a pickaxe. It's misleading you. <laughs> Good lord. 
<laughs> no, because these are the dried ones. Alright, let's see. These are all part baked. That's part baked. bring this up by a few degrees yeah yeah acorns is a weird mod it says place on ground whack with a mallet but then in the handbook it shows only broken but only obtained when broken by pickaxe and then it takes forever to break it by pickaxe Come on. This is this is why it takes forever. Like my nuggets have already cooked all the way. Like it's just it's going to take forever now. Like, you can slowly see it breaking. Like, oh my gosh, come on. Because you see in my inventory, I didn't get shelled acorns. Obtained by breaking this block with a pickaxe, but it doesn't want to break with a pickaxe. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Is it because it's next to other ones? What's going on? <laughs> is it like it even shows rock sniffer like what <laughs> mallet wooden mallet maybe I, I don't know <laughs> that doesn't seem right Maybe a new pickaxe? What's going on? No! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Just let me have it! <laughs> it shouldn't take this long! <laughs> Make a wooden mallet. How do you make the wooden mallet head? It's a okay. <laughs> I feel so defeated. Oh, and then I need a stick, which I threw into one of these. <sighs> Will it be this? Oh my god, it is actually a wooden mallet. I am... I am beyond mad. It's because of, uh... I think I know why. I know why it is. I know why it is. Uh... <laughs> I know why it is. Weak tannin. I'm not going to be able to use those for that. So, it's because of, um... Oh, words are escaping me. 
It is because of uh, expanded foods. That's why it's like that. This is almost done. It's going to open tomorrow. All right, let's sleep. Or at least that should open tomorrow. God, I hope it does. All right. Not fully eaten. Those are still pretty good. Okay. Um, to get hive parts, which will help facilitate faster things, I need to... It's mixing the board with beeswax. How you make a super. Requires hive parts. Okay. And then... A base of any wood. H base. It'll be down here. Langstroth base. That's a lot of hive parts. Good lord. Alright. So we seal that. Those will be done. Roughly the same time? Yeah. Okay. Well, while I'm waiting for those guys to happen. Yeah, it hasn't even... Hasn't even noticed the things around it. Okay. This is almost done. I am so happy. Okay. Um... Throw the bread into not that one, but this one. That's just normal bread. <laughs> Nothing in there. I have some rot. I gotta put it with the rest of my rot, which is somewhere. Um. Like I have rot somewhere. Is it in one of these up here? No. I am so confused, but it is okay. All right. What is the minimum growing temperature for flax? <laughs> flax seeds, cold resistant until negative five C. Mm. Okay. Let's make some, uh... All my... No. Is it up here? No. There's all my quartz. Alright. How many of these become... Glass. Four to two? How many of these will it allow me to put into one? Twenty-four. I gotta max it with charcoal. Alright. We do this. Match it. Alright. Then I grab my iron, which is in here somewhere. And I got tossed around. There it is. Match that. All right. We do not twenty four, but twenty. Yeah, twenty. There we go. And I don't have enough for that because it's five. Not. <laughs> you know what? 
It'll work out. We're lighting these on fire. It'll work out. I'm I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> And you can't even light it on fire because there's not enough charcoal in there. <laughs> okay. Well. Let's get enough charcoal going, right? So we do it like that. We get a ton of these. All right, and we do it like this. All right. Let's get a ton of charcoal, y'all. Hey, bro. This is not going to be enough charcoal or not enough firewood for this. <laughs> Not even close. Maybe? Maybe actually pretty close. Okay, maybe I was lying there. Um, Where'd the one I was using go? Did that break as well? No. Oh, it's on the floor out here. Is that... Is that... We got four stacks of 64. I don't think that'll be enough, sadly. Oh, sick, dude. Hope you enjoy it. Oh, I am so close. I am so mad that I am so close. Oh my god. <laughs> So, so close. <laughs> I just need to mine a couple more trees. Alright, we're mining a couple more trees because I am so close to getting this done. Oh my god. <laughs> And then I gotta remember to close it, too. So that we don't get what happened last time happening again again. Okay. Okay, something that would actually be kind of funny is if I got killed by some, uh... <laughs> by some falling snow. That would actually be kind of funny. <laughs> Alright. That redwood slap sapling is going to take way too long to mature. <laughs> I think it's a bit too cold for it. I'm, I'm so close to charcoal. Please. Please, just let me do it. Yes! <laughs> finally! <laughs> it's finally worked! Alright. You know what? I don't even care if it matches. It's getting packed dirt. Closed up. It's, uh, like right here? Yeah, all right. Break that. Break this. Break that. All right. Ooh, so close. So, so close. A little bit of grass. Oh, so close, so close, so close. I am so happy for this. 
You have no clue. Oh my gosh. Um, how cold? Am I gonna be freezing in my house? Not yet. Okay. Oh, oh boy. I don't see the particles. I see the particles. I see the particles. I'm going to actually remove that top one so that way I can see the particles happening. Uh, it is sealed off down here. Yes. Okay. I don't have to worry about it now, then. Whew. <laughs> oh, I'm so unbelievably happy about that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, I actually got really happy about that really quickly. Oh my gosh. Um. So technically, as one last hurrah for this season, I'm going to... Zero percent moisture. That's fun. <laughs> Immediately extinguished. <laughs> That's funny. That's actually really funny. I actually. <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> Set that up. <laughs> Let's grab some of these and some of these. We do this and then where did it go? Went into here. We're gonna do this. I'm gonna grab eleven of these guys. Uh, what does it take to make torch holders? Torch holder. Two plates on top of each other. All right. My plates are up here. Three, one, two. Oh, and you get two from them. Okay. Cool. And then into here, I'm just going to toss them. And I'm going to set these guys up around the house for right now. Uh, ooh, ooh, this is going to get very cursed very quickly. I like this. <laughs> it's going to get cursed very quickly. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, let's go place these guys. Oh, they were placed placed, not... Okay. Never mind. It's not going to be as awful as I thought it was going to be. Dang it. <laughs> oh, okay. Can I just... Yeah, I can. Okay. Okay. All right, let's uh, let's place these guys in. I don't know how horsetail grew on that, but that's pretty cool. Is it gonna go up some? Again, I wonder what the rule is for farmland. 
because it is taking a while to like actually update. But it does not matter because um I don't care too much. They've been foul for a good amount of time. So they're getting filled. <laughs> they're eventually going to get moistured, right? Alright. Eventually. <laughs> what does it take to make a watering can? Water. Ing. Can. Can you only make it out of... Yeah, you can only make it out of porcelain. Or out of, a uh, Clay. That's actually kind of funny. Let's see how much clay it takes to make a watering can. Hopefully not a whole lot. I mean, I did make it fully usable, so. Raw watering can. 0% moisture. Come on, guys. These guys are going to grow at 20 at this speed. But that is okay. I'm going to come in here with enough moisture for them all. In a little bit. <laughs> I'm going to place this here. Going to grab some of my stuff that's over here. Thirteen hours in my inventory, and yet it still hasn't gone bad. Interesting. <laughs> I have cooked crab, Lucky Tommy. Let's eat those, and then I can grab some of my older pies. Twenty-two, twenty-two, twenty-nine. Alright, let's go with the cranberry pie. Ooh, can you do a vegetable pot? I wonder. <laughs> All right, I'm down over here. All right, yeah, no, it's grass first. What in the world? That's weird. Uh, another rift spawned behind my house, I think. <laughs> That's great. Cool. All right, now we do right sticks and then firewood and firewood. We heat it up. Step back a little bit. All right, I remember you need to cover it. Yeah, I, uh, I just haven't gotten around to, like, actually lighting up my area yet. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. I just haven't yet. <laughs> I know I should, I just haven't. Like, one thing that I know that I can do is that I can give, 
a higher light level in this area by just throwing this here. Because, I mean, what's, what's the worst that could happen? Throwing a uh, torch up in your rafters, right? Um, what I wanted to make was some lamp posts. What does it take to make a lamp post again? The signpost looks funky. Lamp post. Those two, two. Okay. Well, I have one in here. I know I have one up here. So I could just make one right here. Do that. Bro. Here. Is that not a real one in there? What is going on? No? No problem, Lazzy. Uh, stop by whenever you want, man. I don't mind. I'm glad to have people stop by. Enjoy your dinner. Alright. There we go. And then you old hammer. Is it in there? It's there. Lamp post. <laughs> I will place this. Just not right now. <laughs> I'm gonna wait till I wake up for that. Alright. Three in the morning. Look at how bright it is outside, y'all. That's my windmill going. Oh, he's over here. That one's dead. That one's running away. Cool. Uh... Where'd my knife go? Where's my knife? Dang it. That sucks. My knife has gone missing. Alright, let's see. Is this directional? It is. Just place it like this. Let me go grab one of my lamps. One of the many that I have shoved away. It's in one of them. There it is. And. There we go. Look at that. No lining, but who needs a lining, right? All right, and these three are done. So let's go ahead and break them. And this one should have my iron bloom in it, or just a full-on iron ingot. Yep, that's uh, that's what's supposed to come out of that. <laughs> 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 You're supposed to get an iron bloom, dude. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to get an iron bloom and then you break that down into that. What the heck? Something broke. <laughs> <laughs> well, something broke there. Um <laughs> Oh my god, that caught me off guard. <laughs> okay. 
Oh my god! <laughs> that that fully just. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Oh, that broke me. I'm sorry. <laughs> um. Oh, I can make Timbron Springs for my door. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. That like that like actually broke me for a second there. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, what? What why is there one in night here? What the heck? Well, I was sure that I wouldn't have to do this in here, but I guess I will. Okay. Uh, we can throw one more in there. I mean, uh, that is surely bright enough. Like... Bright enough for me, at least. And I can, uh... On that, place that there. That's way too low. Maybe there? Nope, that's in the way of shit. So I guess one of these oil lamps will be enough. <laughs> but good lord. That that caught me off so guard that caught me off guard so bad. <clears throat> Anyways, I'm sure that the uh the ice out here has or the water out here is refrozen into ice. It has. So it looks like it's going to be a constant battle of coming back out here and uh, re redoing this. But that is okay. So I got too warm for the snow. Oh my god, it unlit itself. Okay. Uh, how are the pine trees doing? Too cold? No. Actually, almost fully grown. That's actually kind of cool. It's also very cloudy today. The forget-me-not caught on fire. Okay. Oh yeah, no, that's gonna take a while. Less than one day, less than one day, less than one day. Yeah, because these guys are causing uh, see-through-the-world texture glitches. <laughs> yeah. I mean, the, the big thing that I could probably do is, like, just sleep through it all, you know? What's, but where's the fun in that? Right. Okay. Uh, the salted meat should be done. <laughs> salted meat is done. Good for eight years. I've got four huge things of soaked hide. I need to scrape these with my knife that has disappeared again. It probably got put away into one of these. Maybe. Did I put it on a wall? Did I put it into one of these? No, I did not. I have a tin bronze knife that has just disappeared. Right there. Or at least this is one of them. Scraped hide. Alright. 
Into the tannins it goes. Three days of sealing. Okay. Beeswax with boards that I have a lot of. I have a lot of oak boards. Five. Two days of sealing will become five hive parts. Hive part. Required for all of the above. Yeah. Need a whole lot more. Super racks. Where's the the brood box top? Where's the brood box? Oh. Super base frame rack brood box top. Frame rack. Holding frames that need to be scraped, clean, repaired, or filled with a frame liner. Place a frame, use wax twine or wax linen to repair it. Move honeycomb. Okay. Well, I'm going to wait until I have more in here. I'm sure I'm not going to be able to fit 50 in there. 10 things of lime water. Um... Six for those. What is it for small hides? Two. So I can do five small hides. Uh, no, I can do one medium hide. That'll take three days. This will be fine. Do I have stuff up here? I for always forget. I can't remember if I actually put anything in the chests up here yet. Okay. Um, well, I mean, I could go crazy and just start planting things, right? Um, I know I have my spiles somewhere. I can stick those into the spruce trees for now. And I can put my... Gently siphon... Resin, fresh resin portion, uh, basics. Bucket or saucepan beneath to collect sap from a tree during certain times of year. So we grab one of my saucepans. What did I just pull off? I don't know what I just pulled off. I will have to find out later. I'm going to come over here to one of my pine trees. And over here, I'm going to place the saucepan down, grab a spile, boom. Now, the fresh resin is from March to November, so eventually some will go into that. <laughs> All right. Or I could just do a bucket. A bucket would probably be smarter. So let me pick this guy back up. Do that. Also, yeah, I'm not I'm not going crazy. This like actually makes the area around it just darker. That is hilarious. I noticed what I picked up. <laughs> I picked up one of the hammers. I picked up a hammer. That is that is what has happened. Well, even if these guys only produce 50% of the yield, that'll be fine. I just want flax right now. Um. Okay. Uh, if I remember correctly, propolis is 
a protein source. What? What? <laughs> okay. It is a protein source. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's toss those in there. I honestly don't have any more use for that right now. Um, what am I going to do? Hmm. I could salt more meat, but why would I do that? It takes so long. 1.5 days. It takes so long. <laughs> and it's not even really worth it. Not really, at least. It's not even really worth it at that point. Um, yeah. All right, let's make a... Let's actually go plant some acorns, get a bunch of oak trees. It may be too cold for them, but who gives a shit? We'll sprout in one day. We'll sprout in a day. We go. It's brought in the day. And I don't care if they are planted close to each other. Because I will be able to harvest them easier that way, actually. <laughs> that seems like a contradiction, Popper. That seems like a contradiction. <laughs> All right. <gasps> it's done. 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 I have a shovel. I have a shovel. This is gonna be great. This is gonna be great. Let's see how much of this, uh, <coughs> Mmm. I'm going to be so happy. So much charcoal. I actually want to see how much charcoal I end up getting. Let's go. I know it's going to be a lot. Very nice. Yeah, I'm a little bit sad. because I won't be able to get any of my bees to start actually going until spring. I have a single skep. And I could make a ton more of the ceramic hives for it, but I don't know how far away they will swarm. I'm going to have to do a little bit of research for that. <laughs> Maybe, perchance. Uh, the fun part for me is I'm going to be going to, um, I'm going to be going out like a ways away from this place to try and get some, uh, iron. Oh yeah, did you, <laughs> did you hear? <laughs> did 
Yeah. I, um... I think something is a little bit broken because I just... I put 20 iron into a bloomery and got out a full iron ingot. <laughs> um... So I think something's being a little bit bugged there. But you know what? I'm not really going to complain. Unintentional quality of life. <laughs> so... Fun shit. <laughs> Yeah, the next really fun thing is going to be the, um... Like, the actual... Finding a decently sized iron deposit... Out there. Especially when it is this cold. Uh, how is my... Hoods... How's my stuff holding up? It's alright. Okay. Like, my actual keep warm clothing is doing all right. I'm happy about that. All right. I think I'm going to have enough uh, charcoal for a little while. Not enough for steel, but for a good while. So, this winter will actually probably be my exploratory season. Because of how, um, <laughs> how all over the place this, this world is at the moment. I don't have a good deposit of iron close by, I don't have really anything. I need to go caving at some point. Alright. Let's get this last bit of glass going. Alright. Light on fire. Boom. Now I get to break the ice that is formed here. This will take forever to grow, but you know what? That'll be perfectly fine. <laughs> Ooh, uh, is my watering can done? Not yet. All right. I have any resin? <gasps> Point two liters of fresh resin. Let's go. Until the end of November, I will be getting some resin. For free. Alright. Well. Let me go stock up for some exploratory stuff. Too cold. That's okay. Alright, let's throw the bloomery stuff up here. I'll hold that in my hand. Even though th technically that is better. I don't care. All right, we do this, press Y, get rid of the dry grass, get rid of the fire clay. I have some food on me. All right, right, what did I want glass for? Glass planes can be used for that, right. And pain plain glass gets you more. Okay. How do you get the... Alright, yeah, use a... Use a saw. That makes sense. We got that saw, and one of these two. How many more uses does this guy have in it? Well, I wanted 
these bits anyways. This is okay. Boom. And boom. All right. Can I just do this? No, you have to place it and you have to change it. It would seem. Okay. Grab that. All right. Gonna place all these down. How do you... This is just going to shatter, isn't it? How do you change the glass? Change the color. Oh, it's only for color changing. Okay. Is there a way to just pick this up? Yes, with my hand. Okay. Well, I guess I just have to make them better. <laughs> that's the that's the plain and simple answer for that. All right. Well, the lighting has upgraded in the house, y'all. It doesn't really look like it, but it has. Are these solid? They are solid. Okay. Can I... Clip these on? No, I cannot. It's a, it's a mining lantern that can, though. Lantern... Simple mining. Brass with copper. Copper lead. Life level 24. Lump of fat. Twine. What about simple one? Requires a flower pot. Has a light level of 16. Cool. Paper lantern. Very descriptive. Oh. Wow. Um, that's actually really cheap to make a level 21 light source. Holy cow. That's like unreasonably cheap. Wait, so I went lower and it got warmer. Yeah, right. <laughs> Empty. Okay. Yeah, I waited too long to try and harvest these guys. Well, at least the moisture's going up. Alright. Let me empty my inventory out. I don't need all of these guys on me. <laughs> I don't need the scythe on me right now. I don't need... Eh, I may need the shovel. Knife. I don't need the copious amounts of charcoal at the moment. Or the lanterns, really. Or the aged torch holders. Or that. Or those. Or that. Or the cauldron. Or the packed dirt. Or that. <laughs> A lot of things I don't need, honestly. That I have on me. The rice can live in there for right now. Two years in that. Sweet. Uh... I can make a spring. Let me make a spring, actually. I'll make two. All right. I like that. Throw that back up in there. I'll throw... You know, I might as well. Uh, 
Right, I gotta wait for those to get hot and then I can heat up the iron. Throw these guys in here. There. Why? Toss the copper bits in here. I don't need the wooden mallet. That'll be useful. Toss that there. Toss one more on top of this. I've lowered the overall temperature, but... It don't matter with these. Okay. All right, now we come out here to hit on these. I want a tin bronze spring. We're going to auto complete it. There are a lot of things that require the removal of bits. So, wait, what was the metal worker? No, metal recovery. Every four splits you've done. Oh, uh, I guess it's useless if I'm like this. Okay. That's okay. Three, four, five. And now if I just change it to split. And we can do these. Being a bit risky there. All right, and then we do <clears throat> pick accent. Let me auto complete it first. And then we turn over to split. Boom, boom. And there we go. H, ingredient for wooden door with tin bronze spring. So, if I break this door. There we go. And I combine it with a spring. All right. Wooden door, wooden door oak. Requires an oak door. Okay. I can work with that. Requires an oak door? I'll make an oak door. I'll make two of them. Door oak. Grab two of them. And after a short amount of time, it will automatically close. There it goes. As you hear. Alright, so now I don't need to worry about closing my doors anymore. Alright. This... It's gonna set it there. We are going to make a... Iron pickaxe head. Alright. Let's check the rest of these. Pantograph. These saw blades would be really nice, but they're kind of useful, useless right now. Yeah, I'm gonna do a pickaxe head. Let's 
Gonna get some iron back after this. Three, four. Gonna split. go last one how many four iron bits cool all right and now i can toss the rest of this out because there are a ton of sticks down here i do one and two i've got an iron pick and a 10 bronze one Pickaxe. What are the different types of pickaxes? Okay. Golden. Durability of 115. <laughs> uh, steel pickaxe. Cool, cool, cool. Tier 5? Diamond tip steel pickaxe. Okay. Rough diamonds. All right. Cool, cool. Toss this guy here. I should grab a couple more pies, honestly. That scared the shit out of me. <laughs> it's gonna take a little bit of getting used to, to for that. All right. Now let me go toss these bits up here. So, tin bronze up there, that there. All right. So, do I go over here? Oh no, I need to also grab my So my rock sniffer yeah that's the rock sniffer I don't need the rock sniffer just yet I need the prospecting pick I really should make a 10 bronze prospecting pick I go to look at that right as it uh <laughs> burns out. Okay. Grab one of these here. Ignite it. Here we go. <sighs> okay. I thought I was done with smithing. I am not. <clears throat> All right, get that to a working temperature. I want it to start glowing slightly. And then we rush it over there and I can start working on it. Let's let it get to about 500 C. And then, boom. Now nah, it's not workable yet. Oops. Let me uh, let me let it get a little bit hotter. I forget what the workable temps are for these guys. I'm being fully honest. All right. Boom. Prospecting pick. We do auto complete. Now we do splitting. And there we go. Two tin bronze bits. 
Alright. We do... Pop these up in here. There's that. We grab two sticks. And the prospecting heads. And there we go. All right. Mining bag is big enough. We grab one of my many, 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 many hay beds. That's the only other thing we carry with us. We grab that. We'll wake up in the morning. Is that? I can actually pull those out, toss them up here. I can not burn them, but they can be burned. So I will find something that is burnable, such as these common ferns, toss them in there, toss that one in here, grab a torch, ignite it, and we toss the other one in there. All right. How many? Ooh. How many more candles can I make? Six. Okay. <sighs> put all of my. Yeah, I put that all up there. these extras and I can divide those in half I have the six that I have here it's there Do that. one there toss the rest in there and I can head off all right uh, actually, let me grab my ladders that I know I have stashed somewhere in here. There they are. Boom, boom. Put one of them in my inventory. Uh, honestly, how often do I need to use that? I will probably need to use that more often. And I know in this one, I have some rope ladders. Which will help me get down from a high space. I mean, so will normal ladders, but who's really keeping count? Alright. Well, let's head over now. How many? 0.7 liters of fresh resin. That'll only last for a few days more. <laughs> Alright, so the idea is we get over to here. We'll pin that. I did not pin it. Pin, save, and then... Now I know which direction I'm heading in. We, uh, we will not be ending... <laughs> ...stream in a, a friendly place, my friends. We will, uh, we will very much not be. And in all honesty, I probably did not grab enough food. So let me head back and grab as much food as possible. Let me grab some of my bread.
Yeah, actually, let me grab some of the bread. That might be smarter of me. Because whew, these are lasting five days. This one's lasting two. I'll probably be out for longer than that. Oh. Ooh, my watering can is also probably done. Not that it really will matter. In all honesty. Let me actually grab that. I think I can come down here. Fill it up. 100% full. And, uh, what are the bits that aren't watered yet? Even though it's cold enough that it'll stunt their growth. This will this will just be funny. Yeah. Like I said, it'll just be funny. Yeah, let's grab some more. Let's see. Good for a couple of years. Got my knife on me, so it'll be easy to chop up. Alright, let's see. Which one of these will give me the most saturation when fully cooked into something? It's 125. I have some chopped onion here. That's also 125. That is also 125. Okay. So, if from here I grab one of each. Which one lasts longer? 19, 20, 20. So it looks like onions are going to be my way to go. That's fine. Those will also last a couple more days. Um, grab some bowls. I'll need at least six. A couple crocs. How long? Seven, seven, seven. Okay. Well, uh, if I grab my cooking pot, it's somewhere up here. One of them, at least. And... Some amounts of these. Honestly, I don't need the rest of that. The biochar is already done. I want grass. I want grass. Or grass. Do I really need grass? No, I don't. I need at least one of these guys. I can grab some grass on the way up. Okay. For now that on the tip until I'm all the way up there all right literally I can grab grass like right here right now boom there we go now I'm ready and off we go the bed. <clears throat> I have more than enough food now. Iron? 
That is not... I did not click that. Or... It looks like all types? Yeah, all types. Okay. If I... Ooh. Let me turn on... Involuntary item movement. Or... Moving. Weather effects, fog and mist effects are off. Sound effects are all on. That'll be fine. Alright. Let's find a halfway decent iron deposit. All the way out here. Density search. I am also going to grab these guys. Because why not? Ow! Why? I didn't even do anything to you. Asshole. <laughs> that sucked. <laughs> Just took damage for no reason. Alright. Walking around with Itachi out. Let's go. Yeah, I just became soaking wet because of that. That's great. <laughs> Bear. Bear noises. Shit. Oh, I can make that jump. Oh my god. That is amazing. This is still really freaking dangerous. Oh. Yeah, really dangerous. Because over there is the exit out. Mm. Way more damage than I needed to take. Ow. Way more damage than I needed to take. Let me actually grab my, my healing... <laughs> Let me actually grab my healing, ow. That actually really hurt. <laughs> I'll be fine, though. Alright. Once I get around this, I can then head off that way. And then I'll be able to go underneath my massive floating island. And I will actually do some, like, exploration up there. Just not this year. Maybe the next one. Okay. Look at me go! He's zooming. He's zooming. Alright, we do this. We take off the armor for right now. Alright. Then we head this way. Body temperature slowly lowering. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. Look at this. This area here, all this, and it's like right up to here is all lifted above the ground. That'd be incredible. 
I think I have underground farming turned on. So I'd even be able to, um... To, like, actually do some farming up there. I mean, technically I can do some farming down here as well. As long as I keep it warm. How is that? Is that a stalagmite? Yeah, it is. Or a spilothem. Whatever the hell you want to call it. Alright. Alright. Making our way over to the iron deposit. It's also got a couple of guys around there. So I won't be totally alone out there, but they will be annoying as hell. I just thought I probably should have taken one of my axes with me. Um, let's see if I can grab some flint while I'm out here. Because I know the rest of this is... Uh, there we go. I'll be able to grab some... Um, I will be able to grab some uh, sticks along the way. Like right here. They won't be as good as the metal axes I have at home. But they will work. Alright. So now we turn on the prospecting info overlay. Is that dead? No. Also, hi, Floyd. Your, uh, your chair isn't kind of... It's kind of not supported, my friend. <laughs> Just a little bit. Alright. It's in here. An acacia seed. Ooh. Right. I remember there being wolves here. Oh, yeah. I forgot that there were wolves out here. Also, how you doing, huh? How you doing, friend? Yeah. Luxuries Trader. Right, they were all Luxuries Trader, which makes it even worse. <laughs> oh my gosh. Powdered gold. For a chandelier. Oh my god. Like, they were all... Luxuries trader. I can sell glass to this guy. Hey! Fuck off. Like, fuck right off. Jesus. <laughs> Ugh. If I remember correctly, this thing is, like, very close to infinite burning. Alright. Come down over this way? Ooh, I could use their barrel. Right, I remember lighting this area up. And all that. Lobster mushroom. I forget that there's, like, a lot of mushroom here. Okay. Um. We don't go down there, but we do find out what is down here. There's one. More samples. At least three blocks away. So we do this. More. And then we do one, two, three, and then here. We get a reading. Poor iron. Poor chromium, but at least 2% absolute. Alright. Is that a fucking bear? That is a fucking bear. Jesus Christ. That is kind of funny. Not gonna lie. <laughs> two more samples in this area. One, two, three. We do here. One more. We do three up from this one. One, two, three. This block. Boom. 
worse chromium, slightly better iron. If I ever need chromium, I know where to find it, at least. Three there. All right. Three, and then here. And three to this side. One, two, and three. It looks like this area is kind of at a set for iron. So there is at least some below here. Sylvite stones. Ooh. Or suvite, however you say that. All right. Let's do three here. And I have to be crouching, otherwise it doesn't count as me actually digging that block up and says, oh yeah, no, we need more samples. So what I'm doing is trying to find iron. One, two, three. So that way I can get a ton of this out of here. Eh. All right, let's go the next one over then. Come on. Give me a clear area, please. Thank you. All right. Is that? No, my pie, my pie. <laughs> One, two, three. Mind that one. Is that? Let me not shift and try and eat. Maybe that'll help. Yeah, that do that definitely helps. One, two, three. Mind that one out. mine this one. How's the iron? It seems like I'm just getting out of the copper area. Did I not mine this one? I didn't. Apparently. According to the game, at least. Iron's not increasing. So I may just find more chromium. Uh, where does the iron spawn? I forget. Uh, we go to wiki. Mining. Systematic approach. Approach. Ores, come on. <laughs> Ore. Deposit, I guess. All right. see is it hematite that's iron it is okay lignite or lemite and magnetite from sea level five below okay well If I want to be safe, I at least go back over this way. There's copper here. Okay. I guess it does not want to register that. <laughs> 
Well, I guess we just start the mining here then. Alright. That's the plain ones. This is the normal ones. Place that there. And under here, I'm just going to start mining. I think I'm a decent amount above sea level. So it's going to take a little while to get below. All right, yeah, I also haven't done the... Obligatory, I need to... This side. All right? Yeah, I haven't done this side yet. All right. Do... One there. We'll do one here. No, that one. Okay. Well. This one, then. And then... Big. Down some? That one down there. One more. Okay. Maybe one more down? Can we do this one? One more sample. That one. Poor iron. Okay. That's fine. I can work with that. I'll be fine. So this is going to be a decent amount <laughs> of uh, this now for about the rest of the stream tonight. I'm trying to find some iron ore. That'll be about it. Going to get a ton of shale. This I know. Cannot place ladder because there's no spot to attach it to. There's no spot to attach it to. That means it's reached its maximum height. Wait. More chalk. Sick. I have a shit ton of chalk back at home, but that is okay. I have a ton of room in my little backpack here. Yeah. All right. Let's do node search. What's out in this direction? <laughs> Yeah, uh, this this whole area here, the only reason I know it had chalk in it is because some was above ground. Is that? No, that's not all of it yet. Yeah, the only reason I knew that this place. I haven't found any marble, actually. Which is actually quite impressive. Is that andesite? It is. Yeah. Because isn't it, like, the really pretty ones? Right? Yeah. 
It can be used for a bunch of different stuff. It's it's a pretty white. I will give it that. Let's see. White marble rock. Occurs in slate and phyllite. Uh, because I am lazy. Also, it stresses me out. Also, if I do it like this, then I don't have to worry too, too much. I think if I remember correctly, I need to get down into like the single digits for iron in this world or something like that. Well, there's 10. Rich 10, too. Um, yeah. I don't know why it didn't say there was any tin in this. But there's some rich tin here. So I'm going to go ahead and mine that out. Not a whole lot of it, of course, but... Yeah, my sea level's at like 169 or something like that. I'm going to mine out as much of this tin as I can. Even though I have a shit ton of tin back at home. <laughs> yeah. That's why I got the node search tools, too. Yeah, I, that's what I, I pulled it up earlier. Hey, level four in the mining skill. Let's go. Holy cow. This is going to be massive. What was the... Is there 10 in this one? No, there's no 10 in either. <laughs> it doesn't even give it a percentage amount. Holy cow. How, how much tin is there in here? Very large amounts, good lord. And bismuthite. Bismuthnite. Let's go! It's mining time, my friend. Oh yeah, let's, uh, collecting, mining, let's get the mining speed upgrade. Here we go. Gonna have a ton in here. This the guys back upstairs have some uh, storage vessels that I can borrow. Or I can put a bunch of this. Alright, but with ores of plenty, I really should go down until I get... You know. <sighs> some amounts. All right, well, I'm actually going to head back over here. And I'm going to use some of this shale rock that I picked up. And I'm gonna block this off. And in all honesty, I wasn't lying when I said that this gives me anxiety. Where am I? There they are. All right. I 
Let's see how low I can go on this. Let me go to about 90-ish and see if there's any iron that has spawned underneath me. Alright. Well, I'm literally at 99 right now, so let's do this. Let's see... Any iron? Found silver, found olivine, found tin, found quartz. Mmm... Do I dare to do it right now? I'm going to keep going lower until I find some amount. And I have it on the highest search mode for node search. Which makes it even worse. <laughs> There's more tin. It's bountiful this time. Because it goes... Tin chunk. Tin ore. Tin ore space. Yeah, it goes all the way to bountiful. Good lord. <laughs> The fact that I'm just, like, mining past this and trying not to give it any attention is even funnier to me. Yeah, but it also makes it easier for finding stuff. I'm at like 70? Yeah, I'm at 70. Let's do one more. What the heck? Olivine, tin, quart, er, quartz, chromium. Verify huge amounts. Copper, nickel. Oh, I'm hitting the quartz right now, aren't I? I am. Okay. Let's see if I go any lower. How much more am I going to get? Am I going to get any in my search radius? Is the big question. I can go down one more. And then I am out of ladders. Alright. It is currently nine at night upstairs. So, uh, we are sleeping. Actually, you know what? I can go all the way down here. That is a bad idea. <laughs> Why did I even think of that? That is a bad idea. I was like, I can just go down to the bottom of this and just sleep, right? No. No, bad. Bad, bad, bad. You will still be losing stability down there, friend. And I don't have anything on me to help me with stability. Which makes it even funnier. Alright, let's get to where I'm at least still getting some of my stability back, please. It may not be rapidly, but good lord. Can I get some back? <laughs> Nine at night. It's bright outside. Oh, it's not bright outside. It just looks like it. 
Oopsies. Yeah, I can make a little hidey hole to make it so that way I don't look like I'm going insane every single time. How long? Six, seven, six, four. Okay. All right. The fact that ladders go all the way over here would make any person who's so used to playing Minecraft absolutely lose it, dudes. <laughs> Just the fact that you can sit all the way to one side and not worry about it. All right, is there anything down here? Is there any iron? Please. There's titanium and chromium. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I think I'm gonna find more chromium than anything else in this area. I think this was a waste of my time. Mm. Let me go check this village down over here. Uh... I need to make some axes once I get to the top of here. Let's grab one of these guys. All right. Well, that could have been a lot better. And honestly, a point two for iron isn't the best. So I'm going to get up there. Heavy temporal storm approaching. Good God. I'm going to die. I mean, I could also wuss out and just not. You know, like just not let it pass. But where's the fun in that? Right? Oh, those are my burnt out tor torches down there. Okay. Oh, I can't build there because it's claimed by trader. All right. Two exits. These aren't going to last very long, and they're also going to be really slow. But, because I was very smart, these are going to be the best I have for a little while. I just need to make a shit ton of sticks. Alright. Do this. Do that. It is a knife to make it into sticks. This is going to eat through my durability of this thing. Good lord. Okay. Forty-five, not enough. Not nearly enough. Put my axe back in my inventory. If I could, I would break down the, the villagers' houses. That'd be funny. I like how it gets warmer the deeper you go into the earth, though. Well, deeper into the world, I should say. Okay. Do 
trying to get as many of these gone as I can. Going to need at least three stacks of them, I think. Oh, come on. They're right here, though. <laughs> they got claimed by a traitor, so I can't get those mushrooms. That makes me unbelievably mad. <laughs> That is not a laying stick. I thought it was. Is this one out of range? That one's not, so I'm not even going to trance it. common one that's a legendary that's an uncommon that's a common rare rare all right Ah, shite! Hey! I should be wearing this when dealing with wolves. <laughs> All right, sir. The fact that the actual fight music for this game came on at the same time as me fighting this thing is hilarious. Okay. Let's grab my cooked meat from this guy. Throw the rest of that in there. Heal the fuck up. <laughs> I am dying. Wooden path. Cool. Alright. Uh. If I come over this way, I should probably make a. Knife blade. Oof. Yeah, that sucks. Alright. Let me make a couple flint knives, so that way I'm not having to... <laughs> okay, common knife. Alright. Do this. Alright. And then I save maybe half of that. Okay. I'll do about half that. This guy is almost dead. So I need to sparingly use my, uh... <laughs> uh, definitely not. Not with that, not with that amount. Let's be honest. Let's be honest here, you probably really needed that. <laughs> okay. I'm going to head down this way. Uh, let me... Unpin that chalk. And I'm going to head down over this way. 
because there is a small village down over here. And as long as I don't hear any bears, I'm going to be happy. Oh, you know, only. Dude, I have way too much at home. Alum. The looted alum used for making dye, and... I actually need some of this. I will actually need some of this. Um... Why is that not an option? Why why do they not put that in? Screw you guys. Um Let me actually make a mark of it. Boom. Yeah, it's usually really high up. At least for me it is. I don't know if that's base game or not. I'm being fully honest there. It's probably not base game. With, you know, how many mods I have going on. There's a tiny little village over here. I want to see what it has. Yeah, alum is really good for making uh, morded cloth, which is needed for dyeing cloth, it would seem. And just making dyed cloth in general. All right, let's see if I can steal anything from these guys. Packed dirt, it's always good to see. Ooh, if I remember correctly, this is one of the ones that I can... Yeah! So, I have some that I can steal from this guy. I can steal some from that. These guys have... a metal tank. A stove or a furnace and a copper anvil I can steal. Uh, if you have the materials as well as some payment for work, I can make you a weapon of exceptional quality, except I don't know what. Iron, charcoal, five rusty gears. Um, if I go to my waypoint manager. Let me make one right here. Did that make one? It did not. That one, however, did. Alright. Go here. We're gonna edit this one. I need to know how to pull up the quests without, um, having to do this all the time. Is it this guy? Yeah. Iron, charcoal, gear. But I don't have any of either for them, so that'll have to wait. Turnip. Okay. He's just got soil inside of his house. That's great. All right. Let's see what's over here. Nobody inside. What kind of corn do y'all have? You have a granite corn. Cool, cool, cool. Dead flax. Somehow your parsnips are still growing. I question that. But okay. 
And there's one more. No, there's a couple more houses over here. Is this guy? Carrots. I don't need carrots right now. Is this the house that I checked? It is not. There's an extravagant guy here. Cool. Cool. You guys have nothing that I would want. Blue clay here. Another house down this way. And another thing to run sack to. Hello? Turnips. Okay. Well, this place was kind of a dud, but that is okay. It has given me a little bit more variety in my food. And honestly, if I want more parsnips, I can just toss them. Alright, let's actually find out what is here. You do a density search. One there. One there. One here. Very poor iron ore. Oof. Oof. <laughs> uh, so maybe I need to travel up this way for some better iron ore chance. So I guess back the way I came. Ish. Ouch. Yes, but it's poor iron density. Zero absolute. Up here, it was at least 0 0.2. Let me check this mountain over here. Like, this mountain range area over here seems like it'd be pretty good. Let's find out. Because iron and all that is based off a of sea level. Yeah. Poor reading on the pro pick means no reading on the pro pick, pretty much. Alright. <laughs> Words to live by, my friend. <laughs> Alright, we do... This one right here. How's the ore over here? It doesn't even show up. Okay. So let's head up over this direction then. Because the density is awful. Oh, right. Yeah, the heavy temporal storm that I didn't completely forget about. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> it's even right up there at the top. Yeah, no, I didn't forget about that. You forgot about it. Oops. Um. <laughs> it's literally sitting right here staring me in the face and I forgot about it. Alright. We do one here. Cause a small avalanche. We do one here. Not cause a small avalanche. Then we'll do one over here. Brilliant. My thoughts exactly. And it still sucks. Okay. So we're going to come down here. We're going to grab one of these. And then we're just going to block over the top of my head. And we're just going to wait until the temporal storm disappears. Because <laughs> I don't I don't want to deal with this right now. So... The iron chances didn't change at all. Oh! <laughs> that actually sucks. Very true. Well,
best I can do for this is uh, kill myself, apparently. Ow, asshole. And I died down here. <sighs> uh, fun shit. How far away did I die? Let's uh let's find out. <laughs> two point five thousand meters away. Or two point five hundred meters away. That is hilarious. Oh right, yeah, I made that a spring one, didn't I? Describe that. Oh, that was very smart on my part. <laughs> mm-hmm. Let me grab some of my food. It's massive. <laughs> yep. That's how it always is. Ah. Come here, big guy. He's dead. Yeet me across the floor, apparently. Uh, what's the other weapon I have? The Akawa, which is up here. There it is. Uh, no, it's the Spontoon. Come on, big boys. I really, really need to get these things done. Ugh. I mean, if I'm going to search for iron, I might as well get at least a decent reading on it, right? I have a ton of these guys spawning, too. Yeah, I meant, like, on the pro pick. But, yeah. I'm getting at least poor on some of the ones that I, like, really need. There's some iron out here. I just hate it. There's probably some guys who have spawned up here. Against my best wishes. Hey. I had a knife. I put the knife away. I don't know why I did that. At least there's less spawning chances for these guys out here. <laughs> Funny opening sounds, I guess. Come on, assholes. Dang.
<laughs> That's huge. You know what? I'm gonna be funny. Let's go out. I'm gonna climb up this to where they can't even reach me. I'm just gonna stare out at, at these things. Like, look at the massive cogs, guys. Ho. Oh. Like, look at them. Ain't this game neat? Giving you mild eldritch horror? Look at him. I don't know how much longer this storm's going to really last. But I get, at least I get to have the cool fun out here in my <laughs> on my windmill. Yeah, they're awesome. What percentage am I at? 58. Wow. Yeah, so I guess I get to, um... Yeah, it's pinned. Okay. Oh, yeah. Alright, well, I think... The goal for the rest of the stream will be to get home. These, like, actually knock you? No. Okay. Is to get the... You know, get the, um... <laughs> my body back. Like, all my stuff back. And then, uh, we can end stream. I'll, I'll find my way back home. That I know how to do. I know how to do that actually kind of well. <laughs> Oh, I am cold. It's actually getting like cold in real life now, and it's both great and awful at the same time. Like if I was less of a whip, I'd go down there and like actually fight these things, but I am a massive freaking wimp. <laughs> Like, I can and will just completely forget that those things are down there. Well, there, there goes the storm. We got one, two, three guys down there. There's a... A, <laughs> a pig over there. Good seam. There's one down over there. A couple down there. Got me to 45%, y'all. Good lord. Look, they're trying so hard to get up here to me. Not. The fuck is in the dust. As soon as this storm stops. There it goes. Okay. Ow! <laughs> that actually scared me. Holy cow. Sorry. I didn't mean to yell. But like... That was, that was a little bit deserved, you have to admit. Okay. Going to place that there. Open the door. It's going to close on its own in a couple seconds. I do. <laughs> It looks like some of the really scary ones, like, actually got stuck. 
so I don't need to worry too much about that. Okay. So we grab the other Haven. And... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, let's see. I need Fordage. And it's to make a raft, right? Yeah. Four. One, two, three, four. All right. And then... Looks like I have to make it out of oak. Okay. I'm going to grab one more piece of food. Not going to be much, but it's going to be enough. And uh, I'm going to get up and out of here. No, I'm not. I'm going to bed. Good lord. Yeah, for for my copper, I literally just broke it all down and put it into a ch into a uh, better crate. And um, why do I keep trying to sneak to eat it? What in the world? <laughs> yeah, I've got I've got a few nuggets, as you can see. guy's gone. Alright, let's GTFO. <laughs> okay, so the reason I am laughing really hard at that is because apparently the asterisk is how you make things louder with my TTS. <laughs> um, that was really funny. <laughs> I think it has to be a asterisk after every word because it said lol asterisk. Or it said, uh, Psy asterisk. <laughs> Just very loudly. <laughs> that was fairly humorous to me. Thank you for that. <laughs> Alright. Going to grab a dead body. It'll take a little bit. <laughs> oh, very much so. You're doing my job better than I am. <laughs> oh, I just need to get the water. I don't even need to be, like, all fancy about it. Slight amount of damage, but that is okay. 
Because I can just exit. I forgot that you keep your stuff on you when you die. <laughs> so I thought, oh crap, I'm going to have to make more clothes. And then I didn't, and I was very happy. <laughs> I need to find a fairly large, like, gravel or sand desert or something. So that way I can finally continuously use my sluice, so that way I can get a bunch more stuff. Because <laughs> it'll be nice. Alright. Okay. So it seems... Yeah, going underneath, continuing through here will probably be my best course of action for right now. <laughs> this place is so cool up here. It'd be so cool to have, like, a little base up there. And it looks like it's in a decently, a st a decently stable area, too. But being up there, it would be so cold all the time. <laughs> Oh. Like it's <laughs> Like it's still so cold up there that the snow still hasn't melted. All right. We're going to cut across this way. Alright. So it looks like cutting through this forest is going to be the best idea. Unless... Uh, some kind of animal attacks me. Which it probably will. <laughs> and honestly, I'm ready for it. I'm ready for whatever happens. I'm not very prepared, but I'm ready for whatever happens. If I go into the double digits of death finally, uh, that that's just gonna happen. I'm ready for it, dude. Oh, there's resin on a tree down here. Cool. <laughs> I wonder how much resin I actually collected in that uh, pan out there. Or in the uh, thing that I placed down. Wolves, yay! I know that wolves are typically there to protect their young, but Jesus Christ. Are they still following me? No. Okay. God, I hope not, at least. <laughs> Here's my body. Pick it up. Oh, screw you. <laughs> Alright. Well, I have most of it. Yeah, with the increased spawn chance of them. <laughs> or at least that's what it feels like. Alright, we'll do... The plain ones here. Pop those up there. <laughs> 
guys. Alright. Get that. Tachi there. 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 Alright. Like, I'm very, very thankful that they nerfed the, the spawn chant, or like the, the follow distance form. Alright. Let's see. I know, it sucks, right? One, two, three, four. Yeah, I had one literally just like followed me all the way home and I was too scared to like actually beat it up. So it just lived near where I was near where I had set up base. <laughs> Very poor iron. Okay, so let's travel up this way then. Well, here's a bunch of gravel. All right. Travel up this way. I wonder what it's going to be like. There's a small mountain here. All right. This is like right beside where I had stopped. There was a ton of chromium down below. I do remember that. One, two, three. Four. One more. This one. Alright, what's the iron amount in this one? Point one. Okay. So, let's go diagonally this way. That's more pairs. All right. Get a small clearing. Here we go. <laughs> we get this guy. All right. Three, four. There we go. And one, two, three, four. Zero percent absolute. Holy cow. So is it down this way then? It has to have been, right? Or there's just a very poor iron just in this entire area. Like almost none. To the point where it is a comical idea to even think of trying to get some. Or maybe it's just really, really far down. One, two, three, four. Three. No. <laughs> no. We go down one more. No, I'm not down in the mines right now. Point three absolute. Uh, I'm going to travel one more down this way. No. No, that bell was coming from you. Which sucks for you, I guess. <laughs> one, three, four, three, four. <laughs> four. All right, there we go. Find out if the iron go up or go down. It stayed the same. 
All right, we go one more diagonal. Was this fluke or was this just me getting really lucky? Let's find out. We're in conglomerate right now. We'll do this one first. No, Paradite. One there. I fell into the hole, but that is okay. Because I have more than enough to get out. All right. Point two. All right. Is this one still a point two? Gather some resin real quick. All right. Get back into the chunk. And there. And then we can do one here, I believe. All right. <laughs> one there. One there. And one here. Poor iron. Okay. Poor iron density. What about this one? Because this one right beside me was a point two, or no, a point three. Do three. We go one, two, three. There's number four. All right. Do this one first. All right. Then this guy. Point two. So is it this way? Jack-o'-lantern mushroom. Do three here, and then three, and then it's this one right here. Nope. Uh, it was one too far over. Alright. This one? This one. And then this one. Decent iron. Okay. Um looks like going a little bit further that way may be our best chance. A little bit more resin. All right. All right, let's find out if this chunk has anything in it for me. All right. All right. I 
I'm getting decent iron at least. So one, two, three, four. And then this is still within said chunk. High iron. Ooh. I want to go a little bit further this way. Let's find out if I'm just getting lucky. Oh gosh. Okay. All right. Four. That, I almost broke that. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, so th the thing is, is that I've always been like, oh, it's fine. It'll, it couldn't be worse. It's the amount that I've, like, pushed to the side before. Very high, 0. 0.5. All right. They're still high, but 0. 0.5 absolute. So let's go one more chunk down is that is it going to be higher or lower two three four one two four and i think i can just knock all these down one more and still reach yes This one first. Then do this one. And then this one. Hi, or point five. Ooh. And since this is on a lake, it may be easier for me to just set. Yeah, do this one right here. Okay. So we're doing this guy right here. And we're going down. As far as I can. Um, let me go ahead and eat some pie. However much is less for this. Very nice. Honestly, I should head back home and empty out my inventory. But I'm lazy. I'm not going to. Alright. So I should honestly also set up a little thing like right here. So we do bed here. Maybe just enough room for, like, a little bit of storage. Alright, we take... This. Get rid of that. Mind the rest of this tree out. There we go. Small cave in, but that's fine. This is all okay. All right. this like here and I can throw a little bit of that there and if we block it in I don't need to worry about anything jumping out at me okay Let me actually, like, toss some of this out. Because I do not need either of these. 
I don't need those right now. Okay. What else can I toss out? Not a whole lot, honestly. Uh, that grass is needed. All right. So we're going to mine up a bit of this, make like a little storage thing here. forget exactly how much is needed for a reed basket. Three times eight. That's a lot more than what I have right now. <laughs> that is... I was too lazy to do math and then did the math and said I need 24. <laughs> I'm very smart, guys. Have you been able to tell yet? <laughs> I can do math. Yeah, I can do math. I can do it real well. <laughs> okay, I got 20. Is that enough yet? Not yet. Why did I even test? I knew I needed 24. Like, I know, I knew it, I needed exactly 24. <laughs> I'm just very dumb. Oh my gosh. Okay. Alright, we are going to remove these. Remove these two. And right here, I'm going to place uh... What can I place here that's not going to cause havoc? Not a whole lot of things, honestly. So, let it cause havoc then. up here. Grab that. Place it there. To click some of these over. Some of these not really required to be in here. Alright. We grab one of the more awful lanterns. We want to place it there. All right. Actually, no, we can place it there. Then it's not in the way. <laughs> okay. Then those will be fine. That'll be fine. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. This is like, why do I even have this? <laughs> Alright. Let me also switch this over to density mode. <clears throat> I need to get to... At least level 100. Well, it doesn't matter now. There's Paradite. <laughs> All right. There we go.
All right. Once I get down to the level I need, let's find out how much iron I'm going to have. <laughs> I keep doing that. I really need to stop doing that. <laughs> So at least I know I have a good area for Paradite. Okay. I have a pretty decent area for Iron 2, or uh, Andesite 2. There we go. All right. Once I hit about 99-ish, I will uh, try and find out if there's any nearby me. So this last one should take me to about where I need to be. All right. All right, let's find out. Should be some in this chunk. No ore nodes nearby. May need to do a little bit of sideways mining, I guess. Okay. It could be a lot worse here. Let's go down a few more. All right. Let me check. Tin or very small amounts. Maybe lower. Maybe lower. Silver ore. Very cool. Bountiful amounts, too. I can hear a guy groaning and moaning. Mm. Very large chromiums at medium. This angers me. I'm going to mine this silver because it's bountiful. But it like actually very much angers me that I have not found any yet and I'm at level 67. Statistically, I would have found at least one. Like, at least one. Also, you can hear the, the guys screaming at me. Less screaming, more moaning. How much is each bountiful one for me? 500.
I'm starting to think maybe I should go a little bit more towards the center of the chunk. Maybe that'll help me out. There's the chromium. Chromium. What's it used for, though? Chromium. Dye making. Diluted chromite. Used in making things can also be used in place of alum, it looks like. And it needs steel to break. Of course I don't have steel. Alright, let's do prospecting pick mode. Huge amounts of chromium. Yeah, that three point something percent makes sense. I'm sure if I just keep going down low, I'll find it. You know how that's supposed to work, right? <laughs> Let's check. Any more? <laughs> no ore nodes nearby. <laughs> there is, however, a lot of guys down there. <laughs> All right. Let's, uh... Let's go a little bit this way, actually. Let's see what the, the ore amounts are this way. God, that's a lot of silver. I bet you I'm going to find iron at the very bottom of the world, and that's why I haven't seen any yet. Diagonally enough, correct? No. That's one. Three. That's at least enough, right? High iron. Mm-hmm. But 2.5 absolute chromium! <laughs> oh my gosh. I bet you it is in the middle of the lake is where my most amount is going to be. I bet you that's what it's going to be like. I'm going to lose it if that's the case. <laughs> My god. Ah! I found zinc ore. That's great. What do I use zinc for again? H. Crushes into that. Smelts into zinc. Used for chandeliers. 
brass and a different type of bronze. Cool, 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 cool. All right. I have at least found zinc. Man, it's almost like I wasn't looking for zinc. God dang it. <laughs> oh. I love and hate this. I just want to find some iron, guys. <laughs> I so badly want to find iron. I haven't even been in the Bronze Age very long and I already want to get out. I found 10. Rich 10. I'm standing on top of Rich 10, guys. Okay. One here. One. I'm still in node search mode. Oops. One. Four. That's one. That's two. That's three. That's four? High iron still. Ah. <laughs> I'm getting into more chromium areas. What the heck? So if I go back this way, I dug this direction, correct? Yes. Come back this way. Yep, very dark down here. Do that. Now, not so dark down there. Okay. I'm going to dig this way. Because I want to find if the chromium still will decrease in this direction. Because that one has high or iron but low chromium. That one has high iron but low chromium. But I found chromium before I found iron. My mining skill is going to really increase. <laughs> oh. Going in here, no, you're supposed to go in the bag. All right. I would go down into that pit, search for some iron, but I am not brave enough to do that just yet. gonna go a pretty far ways into this. Alright. One here. One, two, three, four. One here. One, two, three, four. Here. One, two, three, four. 
Is that lower or higher? Two, two. Okay. So now we go this direction. Now we find out, is there anything down this this way that keeps it going down? Because I want to find less chromium, more iron. That's not the pickaxe I meant to be using. down a decent way this way yeah a couple more just to be safe all right cool High tin, poor chromium. Okay. Or high iron, poor chromium. Okay. So it's just it's just lying at this point. Good lord. <laughs> Fight! Fight, dumb fucks. One smacked me right away. I have an idea. All right, let's get back up to the surface real quick. I have an idea. It's going to be so dumb, and I love it. Oh! I'm not going to be able to secure the area down there like, at all for a while. But, I can at least try to do something about it. Alright. Up here, I'm gonna break that. We're going to place this firewood down. Okay. In here... I'm going to take all that soil out. <laughs> Can you see where I'm going with this? <laughs> Alright, let's get a few more ladders. I'm going to try and build a thing around my little shaft. And hopefully that'll help keep the drifters out so that way I don't have to worry about them. I can just keep going down. Let me just, uh...
All right. Oh shit. There's a bell. <laughs> shit. Can we go all the way back up? Yeah, let me go all the way back up, despawn it, respawn. Without any lights. I mean, I can have a light. It's just going to suck. Alright. I'm gonna come all the way back up here. I'm gonna go all the way back down. If the bell is still down here, I'm gonna kill it. I can hear him. There he is. Yeah, hi. You guys are down here a lot. Okay. So if I... Cry like a little bitch boy. <laughs> you use resin and peanut oil. Or any kind of seed oil. Or just beeswax. Holy shit! <laughs> okay, well, uh, I'm gonna have to call this there for now. <laughs> um, something ripped. Heavily tattered. Yeah, these died. Okay. I don't know why I'm glowing, but I'm glowing. Um. Okay. Anyways, yeah, uh... Thanks for stopping by, guys. I don't- I still don't know why I'm glowing. Um... Thanks for stopping by and watching if you did. If you're still here, thank you very much for watching. Uh... Follow stream. Watch the VODs. VODs are up on YouTube if you want to keep watching them. Uh... Thank you. And, uh... I'll see y'all later. Bye.